don't forget to like and subscribe and let's get started so in this video i'm going to show you how to add a drop down to your navigation bar in bootstrap so what i want you to do is that i want you to open this page and this page will be in the description of my video so just one click on it and make sure that you copy this part that says script so it says js so you need to include these three scripts all right so just copy them and paste them inside of the head of your web page so this is the head and i have included that script there without this one it will not work properly so we are going to code this now we are going to enter our code here so this is the links that we have and this is the navigation bar actually so it's an unordered list and it has basically a list items so what i'm going to do is that I'm going to add another list item here underneath it. So another list item, all right? So li and see, so class equals two two quotations that I'm going to say nav dash item. So this is going to be a nav item, and I'm going to say space drop down, all right? So once you do that, go to the next line. Now underneath it, just add an anchor link. So a class, and then I'm going to say nav dash link, all right? Space drop down dash toggle, all right? So what I'm gonna do now is that I'm going to put a space here, then I'm going to say href, and I'm going to add a link here, but I'm going to put a pound here. But you can put a link here, for example, index.html, if you want it to open your index.html, I don't want it to open anything. So I'm going to put a pound sign there. Then I'm going to add an ID here. So ID equals to, we are going to say navbar drop. So navbar drop. All right, so navbar drop. Then we are going to use one last thing. So we are going to say data, all right, or data dash toggle so now we are going to say equals to drop down just like that okay so close it now we have created this link here and inside of that link we are going to say this is a drop down link so we can change this later I just put that there so you can see it. So now I'm going underneath it, and then I'm going to use a div. So I'm going to say div space class. Then we are going to say drop down menu. So drop down menu, drop down dash menu actually. Then we are going to close our div, and then we are going to add links right here. So for example, right now, if we save this and if we look at it, so let's save this. So we're going to save and refresh it. You see that there is our button there, but when we move the mouse over it, it doesn't show anything because we have not added any links here. So we are going to change this to a different thing. So for example, I'm going to say, I'm going to make this shorter. I'm going to call it drop down menu. So drop down menu. That's what I named it. So it will be a short name. Then right here inside of this div, you can add as many links as you want. So I'm going to say less than sign a space class drop down dash item. All right, drop down item. And then I'm going to say href just like uh, making any link. I'm going to put a pound sign here because I don't want to open anything. You know, and I have closed my anchor link here. So this is the end of the link. And I'm going to say, for example, close. All right, so save it and refresh it. Now, if you move the mouse over it and click on it, it will show you that link. So now I'm going to add more items here. So I'm going to copy this one. And I'm going to change this to kids, women, and men. So save it. 
refresh it now if you click on it we have three links so we have successfully created a drop down menu using bootstrap so i hope this video was helpful and if you have any questions you can ask me in the comments below and i'll always be here to help so thank you for watching and i will see you all in the next video